Hey everybody, Rob here for Southwest Florida Television. I wanted to give you an update on what's going on with our Naples Pier, what's left of our Naples Pier. Nothing's really changed since they opened the little section of it at the East End. They're getting ready to, well actually they're in the process of taking bids on the rebuilding right now as I speak. It started March 5th. They're going to be open for 60 days. Down at the west end of the pier, beyond where the concession stand and gazebo used to be, that's where the pier pretty much got wiped out. Only some hand railings left. I think there might be one piece of decking down there. Pretty much just pilings left. Very sad. You know, this pier was built back in 1888. And it originally served as a freight and passenger dock. This was the gateway to Naples, my friends, right here. Down at the base of the pier, there used to be a hotel, a post office. It was a hub of activity. There was like a little rail car, a little tram that would run up and down the pier with freight and baggage. This pier has been destroyed by hurricanes four times in its lifespan and rebuilt. Back in 2015, they put some new decking and handrails on the pier. There's a link in the description of this post where you can see some of that, some aerial views of the new decking being put into place. See under here, four pieces of the decking have been washed away, torn off by Ian's storm surge. In 2017, Hurricane Irma destroyed the west end of the pier. Out beyond the concession stand, the whole west end was closed for, I believe it was about six months before it was rebuilt and reopened. And then of course, September of 2022, Ian ravaged the pier with pounding waves and storm surge. Now it's a shambles, waiting to rebuild. Waiting to be rebuilt. Hit that share button. I know there's a lot of people that would like to see our pier and know what's going on. Read the text in the description of this post. You're going to find a link that's going to take you to the entire rebuilding process. They update. The city of Naples keeps that updated. You're going to be able to see the bids as they come in, see the timeline for rebuilding. Please, please, please give it a share. So many people on social media are asking what's going on with the pier. And there's your answers. All it took me was a 30 second Google search this morning to get all that info. You can do the same. And that's all I can tell you for now. You know, I look at this pier. I don't see the skeleton of the pier. I look at this and I still see fishermen on the pier, my friends sitting up on the benches, dolphins chasing fish, swimming back and forth under the pier, manatees going under the pier. 
the boats out there in the early morning with the fishermen getting their baits. The little snowy egrets sitting on the fishing boats. All those wonderful memories that were made over the years here. So many people, so many wonderful memories from here. The sunsets. People from all over this world know where the Naples Pier is. Back. It's going to look a lot different. It's going to be stronger and better. I've actually seen people standing out here on the shore with a tear in their eye looking at the pier. Kind of have one in my eye right now thinking about it. Thinking about my good friend Roy, our good friend Roy, all the good times we had on this pier. Early in the morning watching the sunrise, watching the dolphins, waiting for our friend Connie to bring her banana bread, hoping she'd show up with her banana bread. That was a highlight in Roy's life. And Connie, if you're watching, thank you. Thank you for being so kind. Well, there you have it, the Naples Pier. Thanks for watching. Tally ho, my friends. Tally ho. For Southwest Florida Television, I'm Rob Stan. God bless.